From this year, we're going to see more efforts in decentralizing South Korea's police force as more duties are handed over to local police units. Our Kim mo tells us why. The presidential office of Cheongwade, the government and the ruling Democratic Party of Korea say they plan to expand South Korea's local autonomous police system. The three groups agreed on Thursday to expand the system to five cities and provinces this year and nationwide by 2021. Currently, the system, which transfers some duties to police units under the control of local governments, has only been test operated in Jeju Island. Under the proposed bill, local police will be able to launch investigations into more practical duties, such as those related to sexual and school violence, safety of the disabled and senior citizens, as well as traffic accidents. They also agreed to give power to mayors and governors to tap the director and senior officials of their local police units. We hope that through this bill, we will be able to come up with customized security policies for every part of the country that reflect each region's needs and particular circumstances. A separate administrative police committee that consists of representatives from the government, police and rival parties will also be formed to supervise and manage their operations. We try to focus on providing a stronger police service close to the public's lives in terms of protection and local administrative affairs. The three sides vowed to cooperate to legislate the bill and proceed with its implementation as soon as possible. If approved, it will mark the first time such a policy had been implemented in Korea's constitutional government. The Moon Jae-in administration has been pushing to adopt the system, making it one of its top agendas to make a safer nation for all. Kim Mo-kyun, Arirang News.